to clean your kitchen equipment in a lake. That's just not right. People could get sick. I'm surprised they haven't. Oh, yeah, she's at a lake. A Chinese restaurant is closed tonight after being caught in the act washing cookware in Old Hickory Lake. Good evening, everyone. This is the video that did them in, taken today and posted to Facebook. Now you can see restaurant workers when it starts to roll here. Restaurant workers are actually shown cleaning what looks like an oven rack in the lake. They're actually scrubbing it there. And the restaurant's called Number One Chinese, and they're in number one trouble tonight with the Metro Health Department. News Force Nancy Amons is live there with the latest. Well, right here is number one Chinese restaurant, and it is closed right now because the Metro Health Department took some, took some very quick action after seeing that video, the video that makes you shake your head, someone cleaning a kitchen grate in the lake. You have to see it to believe it. Restaurant workers scrubbing a greasy kitchen grate in Old Hickory Lake this morning. Then they drive to number one Chinese restaurant on Robinson Road. Oh my God, the lake. I mean, it's the lake, come on. Mary Cap says she's seen them do it for years. She fishes on this lake most mornings. We tried to tell a few people, but nobody believed us. It's like, yeah, they clean the equipment, don't eat there. The woman in purple didn't identify herself. She didn't want to say much to me, except that she didn't know this was going on. An inspector from the Metro Health Department says at first, the restaurant workers denied they were using the lake to wash the cookware until he showed them the video. You confronted them with, their own, with the video? Yes, I did. Later in the afternoon, the health department closed number one Chinese as an imminent health hazard. We don't want to get people sick. Now here's the sign. You can see it says, sorry for the abrupt notice, but we are closed until 6.30 p.m. tonight. Thanks for understanding. Actually, the Metro Health Department says they expect it to be closed a little bit longer. They don't think the cleanup will be all that quick. 